It is 18 November 2020. It is Wednesday of the 33rd week in Ordinary Time. Today is the memorial of St. Rose Philippine Duchesne and also the memorial of the dedication of the Basilica of Saints Peter and Paul, Apostles. Our first reading comes from the book of Revelations. I, John, had a vision of an open door to heaven, and I heard the trumpet-like voice that had spoken to me before, saying, Come up here, and I will show you what must happen afterwards. At once I was caught up in spirit. A throne was there in heaven, and on the throne sat one whose appearance sparkled like jasper and carnelian. Around the throne was a halo as brilliant as an emerald. Surrounding the throne, I saw twenty-four other thrones, on which twenty-four elders sat, dressed in white garments and with gold crowns on their heads. From the throne came flashes of lightning, rumblings and peals of thunder. Seven flaming torches burned in front of the throne, which are the seven spirits of God. In front of the throne was something that resembled a sea of glass, like crystal. In the center and around the throne there were four living creatures, covered with eyes in front and in back. The first creature resembled a lion. The second was like a calf. And the third had a face like that of a man. And the third, the fourth, looked like an eagle in flight. The four living creatures, each of them with six wings, were covered with eyes inside and out. Day and night they did not stop exclaiming, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord God Almighty, who was and who is and who is to come. Whenever the living creatures give glory and honor and thanks to the one who sits on the throne, who lives forever and ever. The twenty-four elders fall down before the one who sits on the throne and worship him, who lives forever and ever. They throw down their crowns before the throne, exclaiming, Worthy are you, Lord, our God, to receive glory and honor and power. For you created all things. Because of your will, they came to be and were created. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God.